Evidently, you have not considered that in this universe, life is a perpetual cycle of production and destruction, both functions being so closely bound together that one is continuously working toward the other, thus bringing about the conservation of the world. Therefore, were anything free from suffering, it would be harmful to the world. That is just what all philosophers say. But since what is destroyed suffers, and what destroys does not experience pleasure, and is itself soon also destroyed, tell me what no philosopher can. Who finds any advantage in this most miserable life of the universe, which is preserved by means of the suffering and the death of the very things that compose it?